Your body is nothing but a host to a massive collection of parasitic organisms ready to cause infection, ready to cause infection, ready to cause infection. You can feel them living and breeding and dying inside of you. Is it? Yeah. Yeah? Thought spiral? What are you thinking? This water has to be like 50% urine. That's the good half. Sorry. I was thinking it's not fair. Okay, so plenty of people with anxiety disorder have fulfilling romantic relationships. Hi. Hi. You and Davis used to be friends. For one summer at camp. Look at you, you're literally a glow. Even if I was. I can't date anyone, you know that. I don't know that. Why can't you? Oh my God. You're sweating. <laughs> They probably think you're just a sweaty freak. You can't have a boyfriend, you can't go to college, you can't even control your own brain. People think I'm completely crazy. No, he doesn't. And things aren't exactly in my strong suit. I'm sort of a new thing and you're doing fine with me. I swear to God, he's so smitten. How do you know? Because I have eyes. How come it's so easy for me to talk to you? Maybe because our hearts are broken in the same places. Being intimate is intimidating for everyone. I bet that if you guys actually kissed, you would not be thinking about 80 million microbes. Aza, for once in your life, do not overthink this. Hey, is everything okay? What is going on with you? Imagine being stuck in my head all the time with no break, no way out. Get out! A lot of my thoughts don't even feel like they're mine. Like, I'm not the real me. We can just take things really slow. You won't feel that way forever. But it's not forever. It's now. Do you think I'll ever be able to actually be with someone? You're the most fascinating person I've ever known. I love you. Everything's gonna be okay. You know why? Because you never give up. That's one of the things I love about you. No matter how scared you are, you never stop trying.